they've been regarded as one of the loudest and strongest student sections in all of college volleyball. Now, I can talk them up all as I want, but uh, they just show you right here. Uh, it's a great atmosphere, no matter what's going on, even if the play's dead, there's always cheers going on, there's no dead time, there's always fun things going on in the block party. The block party's great. Like, Tark Shark, block party. It's so fun to run out here and have everybody screaming for you. Like, it just intensifies our game, makes us feel great when we get a big kill. It just gets the energy going. There's just so much excitement. The, uh, the atmosphere is always great because it's such a confined space. We really can control the game and we can really help out the team. It really makes, gives us uh, an actual job to do and we really bring the noise, we bring the excitement and really uh, bring the emotion to the game. You know, when we had a 10 a.m. match on a Friday when people had class and people are filling the, filling the gym, it's just, it's great to see. We have the best fans in the country, I think. They'll, they'll do anything for us. They'll support us no matter what. Well, all these students here are ready to be loud and they're ready to cheer the Boilers on. Uh, sometimes crowds at the football games get a little quiet, but hey, we always bring the, uh, the noise here. Players seem to really respond to it. I think the block party is the star of the show. And I think the fans that come in are probably more intrigued and more impressed with the block party than they are with our volleyball team. And I think that we're doing a pretty good job this year. Last year it was probably a no contest, okay? But this year our team is playing at a pretty high level. But I think they walk out of here seeing some good things on the floor. But to have a group of student fans that spend the time of making up cheers for every player and, and being so uh, religious almost uh, towards our volleyball team is outstanding. And, and the student support's been great. And I think as we continue to win, uh, some of the community people will recognize that, hey, they got a good volleyball team at Purdue right now. Let's go out and watch them. And then we'll start packing this place every night. With 10 home games still on the schedule, all against Big Ten teams, opponents know all too well the difficulty it is to win in the boiler box with the team behind the team. Reporting from West Lafayette, Indiana, I'm Robbie Donahoe for ESPNU Campus Connection.